Hello guys and girls, voices from the dark here, welcome back to more Bloodborne with Sir Colicus himself, the man with the hammer. In the last episode we checked out and completed the first chalice dungeon. Very good job, very good job Carlicus. everybody's real proud of you. And in today's episode we're gonna mix it up a little and we're going to head out again. There are some bosses standing in our way, but I have been informed that when we do bosses, in a way we make the night progress and that means we might lose out on side quests and such. So we're just going to go back through some areas that we've already been and see if there's been some interesting things that we have missed. The Tomb of Odin. That's strange. The Tomb of Odin is where we fought Gascoigne, I think. I cannot seem to go there. Let's go there manually. Central Yarnum. This is where we fought Mr. Gascoigne. And for some reason the lamp down here does not function. As a means of traveling. Oh, uh, okay, that would be why. Oh, f oh, my gun's not out. Well, if I want to parry, I think I'm going to be needing that gun. Wait, there was a... Wait, did somebody just run past me? What? Wait, who's fighting? Wait. So, a hunter ran past me and is now fighting... Is that hunter on my team? Are we buddies? Or are they both... What? Oh, all right, I'll help you out then. Holy shit. Seems like I can... Seems like this hunter is on my team. I can't seem to target him. Ugh. So let's get him. Yeah. Finish him. Ugh. Who was that? More importantly... Who's this? Is that the person who gave us that emote? That wasn't necessary of you, but you have my thanks. We made it with our lives. You're not bad at all. You must have killed Gascoigne as well, then. He was falling apart, I'm sure it had to be done. But try to keep your hands clean. A hunter should hunt beasts. Leave the hunting of hunters to me. Okay. Approval! That's all I ever want in life. Try to keep your hands clean. Alright. Wash them every day before dinner. Let's switch out. A little bit of approval. There we go. Look at that approval. Alright, good times. It's a fun little... A fun little event. Alright. Let's see what else we can find. What is it? Hunters have told me about the church, about the gods and their love. But do the gods love their creations? I am a doll created by you humans. Would you ever think to love me? Of course. I do love you. Isn't that how you've made me? Oh, I think we're going a little fast now. Hunters have told me. Oh wow, this. You're asking all these difficult questions. I, I, I do not know. I, I must think about it a little bit. Oh. What was that sound? Wait, has that creature always been there? Creature seems new to me. Are you scared of the torch? I take that as a no, all the crows. Alright, let me focus on one of these guys. Oh. oh, crow. Please, not now. Go away. 
Oh, I actually forgot there was a hole behind me. I cannot remember fighting that thing before. Okay. First and foremost. Come here, crows. Let's get rid of them. Oh, I think I'm seen by that thing. Oh, crows, please, bugger off. Okay. I swear I haven't fought that thing here before. It must be one of the things that appear once you have more insight, then. It makes the world a scarier place. Oh, jeez. Alright, onwards. I wanted to get back to the barn where we were in an earlier episode. Because I want to go in and figure out what's in there. I don't have a good feeling about it, but... Oh my g- it's- oh, these creatures are new then. Oh wow. That's spooky. Spooky town population us. Luckily they stagger easily. Well then. Sure is fun having all this insight. Nope. Don't think so. <laughs> Good old thrust. Oof. Uh oh. Uh oh. The doggies come out to play tonight. Oh, this is bad. This is real bad. Surrounded on all sides by hungry beasts. How will Karlikas ever get out? By slashing them. Okay, slashing worked for a while. Then I got stuck on a spear. Yeah, I think I'm just gonna run. Not even bother fighting these things. I'd like those echoes back. Just gotta locate where they're at. That guy down there has them. Gimme them! Gimme them echoes! Hey, hey! Stop right there, criminal scum. Hey doggies. Nice to see ya. Lovely time of day, isn't it? Mmm, beautiful. I know you guys all want to eat my butt. But my butt is precious. My butt is sacred. I want to make my way back up here, really. Oh, boy. But everybody's really mad at me. Oh, boy. They just don't give up, do they? Alright. Can't catch me! Ha 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 ha. Seems like they can't pass. He he he. You guys want to mess with me? I'm the master of missing with the Kirk hammer, okay? Don't even mess with my 0% accuracy. Alright. I'll... Stop! Sit. You jerk. Alright. Here we are then. What's up with this place? Do we have any flame paper? I don't know, we only have bolt paper for now. Alright, let's do this. Let's figure stuff out. Mmm. Oh, that seems familiar. That was one of those creatures. That wasn't the boss, though. A distraction? Where's the real boss? Invisible? There's the real boss. Okay. So the boss spawns in some creatures to fight for it. Nasty woman. The bloody witch. All right. Let's attack them while we can. Oh, hey there, little witch. What are you doing out here? Oh boy, we've been doing some serious damage to her. I wonder if there's a stage two of the boss or we just have really good damage at the moment. 
Ugh. Hey, hey. Good night, witch. Yeah, I figured that was a little too easy. Okay. What now? The Witch of Hemwick has arisen once more. Okay. So what's up with you this time, huh? Ugh. Seems like it's the same old boss, just with more friends. Friends can be a powerful tool indeed. Oh boy. Perhaps some new abilities too. Ugh. Can't make that jump, it seems. Okay. I'm not sure if I should keep killing the summons, but it makes me feel a little safer. The other Witch of Hemwick is healing? What? No, why? Why? What? The oh, frick, somebody! Help! Oh boy. Somebody told me that if something looks very Lovecraftian and scary, they're most likely weak to shock. And the shock seems to be doing a little bit of extra damage to these fools, so... We're gonna stick with that. Why is one of the... Bosses healing? Oh, fuck you. And your mother. She's a loose woman with loose morals. Okay. Hey there, witch! Okay. Good, 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 good. Where are you at? I'm using the sword here because it's it's really good at stun locking the enemy. Kill her, kill her, kill that hag. What about the other witch now? Okay, now I probably have to go and locate the other witch who's been healing in the meantime. Okay, don't focus on the summons, focus on the witch. I mean, if you can do both at the same time, that's good. Like here. Almost got her there. Huh, jump attack. Wonderful. Finish her, finish her. Ignore the friends, just kill the witch. Oh. That was it, it seems. Oh, that was a that was an interesting boss. So she comes in, she spawns in things, she she acts all nasty, and then there's a second one that comes in. Okay, good thing we have our damage. It made it much easier to do with this boss now. Being able to finish those guys in a few blows really helped. Do you want to return to the hunter stream? I'm a bit curious about what's further up. Hope they wouldn't play something super nasty down here, would they? This leads to a whole new area. We'll go back, but I have a feeling it wouldn't. There's an old hunter here. Oh, rune workshop tool, thank you. That's what I've been looking for. I appreciate that. Okay, so with that in hand, we also found a different rune earlier. Air. Visual attacks grants more blood echoes. Cool. Probably good for grinding. Let's get out of this place. Let's start by checking out the runes. I don't know if it costs to engrave the runes. That is that the memory altar? Memorize a carol rune to acquire its eldritch strength. Okay. Oath memory. So we have a couple of memory slots here. Max vials held up plus one. That's good, but it's not that great. More echoes from slain enemies. That just seems like something I would want. Wait, so I can only... Okay, memory slot one. So now we have this. Memory slot two. Beast rune, no. Physical damage reduction, sure. Visceral attacks from more blood echoes. That's good. I think I'll take that. I don't necessarily care because I'll... When's the time I'm going to need 21 blood vials instead of 20 blood vials? I think we're gonna go with that for now. And good! Very good. So, now that we've fought against that boss, we have completed what we wanted to complete it in that area. Then we have Dark Beast Parl. It's really the only one I can think of at the moment. But I thought that whole place was an optional area, so there's something I'm missing somewhere. Welcome home. What is it? Thank you. I'm back Very home, welcome. baby. How many levels can we get? Two levels. Yeah. I'm thinking of just pumping my vitality up to 20 for now. And then figuring out what I want to do next. It's a little bit of a boost to my health bar so I don't die as easily. 
spend the rest on blood vials. We don't carry a lot of them around. I want to test out my new thing. Approval! Yay! She's so happy. Hunter salutation. Are you not... Hey, triumph. Yay. Okay. Good stuff. Yarnum headstone. Where do you want to go then? Sure, there's an area I've missed. Though... Witch's abode. Yeah, seems about right. I think I'm going to go and try to face off against Dark Beast Parl, because I don't really know what else I want to do at the moment. Oops! It, uh, uh, they do so much damage. They do an obscene amount of damage. <sighs> Look at that thing, though. So, somebody's been pointing out that I really should use my transforming attacks more. Because it's... It's good. Transforming attacks are good. So I'll try to keep that in mind. Now, Dark Beast Parl's probably not somebody we're gonna take down on the first try, like the Witch of Hemwick. So, it's all about learning the patterns. Let's see if we can find some good parry timings. And let's just do a general analysis of this mighty foe. Let's go. Hey, Parl. He's freaking terrifying, actually. Okay, so that was not a good paradigming. Oh boy. I wonder if this is a boss where lock on is bad. Oh, is that an AoE? That's AoE. Good to know. Oh boy. I wonder if there's a good paradigming on this one. I'm not sure, though. I shot him right there, but I didn't stop him, so... I think I should not focus on that. Oh, well, he's not that. He doesn't have that much of a health bar. Oh boy. I don't know his movesets well enough. Staying in front of him is, of course, death, but getting around him is also real difficult. He jumps all over the place. Not a lot of info gained. Okay, I'm just gonna ignore my blood echoes. Not a lot of them. Okay, hitbox seems a little generous. That's good. So let's try and stay at, at the butt. Let's try to stay at the butt. Maybe some uh, roll attacks here. Oh. Let's get away from that whenever he does that. Oh. Ugh. Lingering lightning effect on those strikes there. God, look at the- he's so fast! Alright, fine, if you want to back away, sure. I'm gonna take a little break too. Meet again in 15? Sounds good. Ah! Oh boy. My blood vials are gonna disappear though, and then he just one-shot me there. Do this one more time. Come on, Parl. You almost share her name. Whoop. Doink! Oh, that's... That's a great attack. Ah! Range on that, man. Hmm. If I keep struggling, though, I'll have to start grinding for some blood vials. And I think I'll do that at just like the first village. I'll just kill some villagers, get more blood vials, and then go to the boss. Oh, oh. So difficult when he does the double swipes, man. What if I have some gear that's more resistant against lightning, but I haven't really seen that stat all that much. I mean, we're, we're, we're dealing some damage to this guy. It's all about getting to know the boss. Like that. Jeez. Oh, Get fucked. Get shit on, kids. Okay. So if we use a lot of heavy attacks, it looks like we'll be able to push him down into the ground pretty well. 
Unless that was just him running out of lightning or something. We'll figure that out, I guess. Just we're getting ready to dodge here in case he does something. Oh, like that. He's like uh, extra electrifying right now. I don't think that was an AoE he did, but I thought it would be. That's an AoE though. <sighs> it's really hard to get out of there if you're already under him. That's uh, almost halfway though. I think we're gonna need some more blood vials. say that I have. The locals aren't apt to share any local history. <laughs> I'm afraid I may not be of help for much longer. <laughs> oh. Poor guy. That reminds me though, I do want to go and find... Hello? I do want to find that one man. The guy we met by that church who was willing to share some helpful information. But first, let's get a few more vials. Oh! Do you see that shiny? That's where that hunter who helped us out of Gascoigne's boss area just now... That's where she used to be. Okay, I need to remember how to get over there. Over here. Wait, wasn't this where I was just looking? Wait, was is that not an item? What? Oh, come on, that so looked like an item. I am in the right place, right? This is where she was standing, talking. That's where I was just now. There's no other balk. Oh. I guess I misunderstood. Why is there a light inside the bag, though? Sadness. Sadness is real. I believe this is the place we used... Mm, is he gone? Ah. The man who used to be here. I wanted to have a chat with him. Maybe he's moved to a different part of the game. Oh, okay then. Got a couple of extra blood vials, so let's go back and let's try to defeat Dark Beast. Parl. We're also wearing the gear that gives us the most bolt resistance in our inventory. Hopefully we'll uh, stand a bit of a chance against him. Just why do you place them on the way to the boss? They can go suck on a big juicy pineapple. Alright. Let's go baby. You and me Parl. Right here, right now. Let's do this. Yeah. Whoa. Maybe that was that not the A. We maybe that was just a forward slam. I can't tell. That's an A. We though. That's bad town population. Us if we don't get away. And dead. Not dead. Okay, we'll dead. Charge himself up again. Which gives me a chance to hit him! Oh no, if that kid. That does 95% of your health.
Did you hear that? Come on. Come on. Smash him to pieces. I'm not gonna go grinding for blood vials one more time. Ah. Come on. Get away. Why did you dodge into him? Fuck it. Blood of Adela. Help me out here. I think Adela will give me more if I need it. Okay. Oh, fuck. I'm dead. Oh, he fell! Finish him! Finish him! Holy shit. That guy is the biggest nuisance yet. Ah. <sighs> All right, good job, everybody. Did well. Yes, yes. Hmm, yes, quite. 23k. Couple of insight, too. Good, I feel like we deserve those. What was it we picked up, though? What did he give us? I've already forgotten the Spark Hunter badge. Badge crafted in secret by Archibald, the infamous eccentric. He's fascinated by the blue sparks that emanate from the hides of the Dark Beast and dedicated his life to artificial reproduction in the style of inquiry that incidentally closely followed the methodology of Bergenworth. Good for him. I do not care. So we've come to a huge door here. Aha! What lies beyond? Well, we'll find that out in the next episode because I need myself a little bit of a break. Hopefully you've enjoyed and hopefully you will tune in to the next one. Have a still good day. Take care and stay awesome. But most importantly, everybody, stay dark. Goodbye.